Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. So great to see your smiling faces. We are here at my restaurant. It is 5 a.m. in the morning. We're getting ready to do a huge photo shoot for Onassis, which is a second restaurant that I'm gonna be opening here shortly in the spring of 2021. But what we got, and I'll show you shortly, uh, we are doing some top-down photography. Uh, I just got done custom making these wooden panels. If you guys wanna see how I did that, I will put a link right up here. Make sure you go and check it out. Let me just say Icarus coffee tastes so fantastic in the morning. Something about those pre-dawn hours that just makes the coffee pop that much more. Link below the video if you don't have a bag of Icarus coffee yet. With all that being said, let's get this photography session started. Right now we are taking photographs. This is our falafel appetizer and I am using a soft box for constant lighting. And you, as you see, when we built these backdrops yesterday, they were actually lighter color, teal is kind of like the color I was going for, a very light blue and white mixture. That way it really pops and accents more of the orange and tan and brown hues that food normally has. So that's kind of like what we got going on here. Have some accent pieces for some top down shots, top down lays. Uh, Mateo's been doing fantastic cooking all this food for me. So we started at 5 a.m. this morning, it's been crazy. Um, I use this little extra, I just had a little, a little box here that I'm using as a bounce light just to kind of fill in some shadows. And uh, yeah, so let's take some photos real quick. That's what this looks like. Our fried calamari. Right now, I'm just adding some fresh parsley sprigs to the photo. It just really uh, invokes freshness and adds a nice little pop of color to the photo. Cool. That looks so good, dude. So that is not straight. We started shooting, what time did we shoot today? Start at? Uh, about five. five. Started shooting at 5 a.m. this morning. It's already, like I said, 8.42, and we have a full day ahead of us. We only got through the appetizers, but I think each and every dish came out stunning. The downsides of doing all of this food photography is like someone's gotta eat the food or we have to throw it away, so. To the uh, spoils of war. Mm. Fantastic Colin Why, by the way. All right guys, enough with the food photography for now. We are on our way to Onassis in Rockwall where we're gonna meet with Elias Pope, the former owner of that space. And he is actually gonna be letting us purchase some equipment from him. So I brought my chef with me, head chef Aaron. Hi. And we're gonna, we're gonna check it out, see what he's got and go from there. Dude, why are you pulling in here like you own the place? <laughs> What's up, brother? <laughs> What's up, Elias? What's up, man? Good to see you, brother. Good to see you. Well, um, what you guys want? It's pretty much going to be like what we don't want because we want everything. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot. So the audio video system's already in that right there. That's oh, yeah. the chef's cooler. So I can work on price. Same as y'all's. Yeah. So okay. That's part of the lease. I'm not cool. gonna, how many fryers are you thinking? Two. Two. Two? Two? Okay. Yeah. So we, we have those. This one right here is. This works good. Just needs love. And then this one. So the reason for that whole meeting with Elias today was to go over everything that's in his old restaurant and see what I want to keep and what needs to leave. He basically is going to work out this heck of a deal where he's going to leave a lot of the stuff there like the TVs and some of the stainless steel tables and basically like half the stuff. He's like, dude, you can just, just roll with it. The other half, he's going to offer to me to buy which I'm gonna buy because it's gonna save me so much stress and so much headache than trying to go out and 
finding all these items. In addition to all that, he actually is gonna be financing uh, 12 months all the equipment, so it's gonna help me with cash flow. That way I'm not stuck having to shell out like 40K on tons of the kitchen equipment. I can just pay it. As we're making money, I could be paying it off over the next 12 months, so. I think Elias watches these videos. If you, if you do, bro, can't say it again. I am greatly indebted to you. That's gonna be it for the vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed, hope you're entertained. I'm gonna go inside, eat some food, edit this video, and get some sleep. I'll see you guys tomorrow. They move it and they, they break it loose. Okay. But it's not they, they, they don't do it on purpose. They try to do the job. Mm -hmm. The problem was, you know, they don't put enough glue when they do it, the plumbing. Okay. Doesn't but matter. it's always, even before that, it's always had a little water coming in from there. Well, no, the water, they fixed that part. They did? Okay, good. They, this is complete then.